I knew something was wrong because the guy that was standing next to me, his hair was about the color yellow as your shirt. <laughs> and I'm going, well, something's wrong because my hands felt so heavy. And I turned around and I started walking because everything was went dark and that was a bright light. I looked, I think it's these fingers, I'm not sure, but it looked like hamburger coming out of them. And then I passed out. <laughs> like so I woke up at the Kiwani emergency room. Same as losing a loved one, someone dies, part of my, that part of my body died. And I had to go through the morning and I had to learn to do things all over. I don't know how many things went flying across the room. First thing I noticed was her attitude. She was ready to take on the world. You know, 16 years after her accident, she is still upbeat and, you know, no matter the technology, whether it's really simple, whether it's really advanced, being able to take any challenge and really thrive in that environment, learn from it, and be willing to, to work to make their prosthetic successful is as important as the technology that she's being fit with. There we go. Good. Doing all right? Mm -hmm. Good. So, as I started to mention, is that because these muscles weren't used consistently for 16 years, we'll see a lot of fatigue. And so that, that learning curve, that process of learning how to activate these fingers consistently to a satisfactory level is a huge challenge. How's that feel now to have fingers? It feels great. That's awesome. Yes, um, it is. What were some of the things that really proved challenging over the past 16 years without having fingers, especially on your left side, just about everything, buttoning. I had problems buttoning my clothes. My husband would have to help me. Cleaning. I use a broom, and I end up smacking myself in the face with it. Right, right. And driving. Yeah, exactly. Right. To me, it's fantastic. That's right. That's those little things you <laughs> the don't think about. The little things, you know, people just go, oh, yeah, I can do that. Well, I don't, wow, look what I can do. <laughs>